Welcome to part two of ChatGPT Plan Ireland Adventures. Today's agenda recommended by ChatGPT is to stroll a bit in Galway, visit the cliffs of Moher, and head over to Dublin. If you missed part one of our travel adventure planned by ChatGPT, you can check it out after this video and I will link it here. But first, breakfast time. The hotel offers breakfast for around 80 euros per room or for two adults. A full review of the hotel and amazing food here is already on our channel and I will link it here too. Now it's time to do the first item in the list. Yahweh is a beautiful city that gives the coziness vibes. Yes. It's chill and does not feel like a major city. There's a lot to do here, from visiting the cozy streets, museums, shops, and more. Then it was time for us to embark on the breathtaking journey from Galway to the iconic Cliffs of Moher. As you leave Galway, the scenic drive unfolds, the tapestry of nature's beauty. You also get an adrenaline rush from the tiny and curvy roads. We're now at the cliffs of Moore. Look guys, look on the other side already. Uh, it exists there. But you can see it, it's amazing. It's about a four hour drive from Dublin and about two hour drive from Galway. So we're hiking now to go see the castle and then we're gonna go on the other side. We arrived at the cliffs and quickly saw why this place is a must see. The cliffs of Moore standing tall at 700 feet Greet you with an awe-inspiring majesty. Carved by the Atlantic, these cliffs offer a dramatic vista of sheer rock walls and crashing waves. So guys, right now it's super windy. Uh, so this is one thing to be mindful of when you come to visit here. It's gonna be windy, but it's an amazing sight to see. If you can look back there, it's just beautiful. Really beautiful. I tried to uh, fly my drone here, but I don't think it's gonna be possible just because of the wind. I don't wanna lose my drone, so. I don't know, we'll, we'll see. If it's possible, I'm gonna tag the videos over here. But if not, man, this is beautiful. It's just beautiful. Even if I don't have a drone footage, just being able to see it right now, it is just an amazing place to be. So definitely recommend visiting this if you are visiting Ireland. Something to do. For sure, you want to check out the Cliffs of Moher. Guys, I'm up in the mountain, and guess what I see? There's sheep right here, right next to it. This is awesome, this is super cool. So right now we're climbing all the way to the other side. Apparently there's amazing views from the other side, so we're going to check it out right now. We made it, we're right here, as you can see. It's really windy. Uh, one thing to be really careful is getting closer to the edge because you don't want to fall in there. So they do give warnings not to get too close to the edge. So I'm not really close to the edge, but I'm able to see the beautiful, amazing views from here. So just be careful. You don't want to be all the way to the edge, but this is an amazing sight to see guys. Definitely, definitely recommend. 10 out of 10 recommend you visiting here. So for sure, you're not going to be disappointed. A 
O'Brien's tower stands sentinel, providing a panoramic view of the wild beauty that surrounds. As the tour ends, you realize that this journey is not just a drive, it is an experience etched in your soul. If visiting here, plan to spend anywhere between two to four hours to fully experience this grandeur of a place. After our visit, we embark on a three hour drive to Dublin where we'll be spending the evening before making our way to Amsterdam. So we're in our first encounter of the little Irish roads. Alright, not even thank you. And now the world are you doing? Alright, this is a man driving stick on the left side in Ireland. How do you feel? I feel like a European. European yeah. on my boots. <laughs> We got Captain Vanso here. Uh -huh. There he is. It was a little too dark and we couldn't see him. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. 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 I can see you. Oh. <laughs> yes, I made the car. Is that it? Not it, not it. Right. No, no. Go to the right. It's not it, not it. To the right. Sometimes it doesn't. It doesn't sometimes. It just keeps you from going. We arrive at the Moxie Hotel where we'll be spending the night. This hotel is really beautiful. Initially, I was not a fan of the Moxie concept, but little by little, I am falling in love with it. I will have a separate video of the stay overview, so be on the lookout for that. After our check-in, we enjoyed our welcome drinks at the hotel bar before making our way to dinner and exploration of the city. Alright, we're drinking this for baby Enoch. Baby Enoch. Alright, Enoch not joining us. Alright, cheers. Alright, guys, I have not been updating, but, anyways, we are here in Dublin now. We were just uh, in Galway earlier today. <laughs> no, thank you. We were just in uh, Galway and then we went to visit the cliffs some more. And now we are in Dublin. So we're only here for the night. And then tomorrow morning, we're heading to Amsterdam. So hopefully you enjoy watching this still. Let's go grab some food. Thank you. Thank you. 
<laughs> Dublin for sure is a great city for foodies and those who are looking for a great pub atmosphere. We will have a full vlog of this city soon on our channel. I know that I have promised a slew of videos to come by the channel, so I will stick to my word. However, I will ask that you also help us to stick to our word by doing the following. One, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Two, leave a comment on the video and let us know what you like or did not like. And always be respectful in the comments. Three, if you're not a subscriber, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you again for watching and we will see you in the next video, which will be the Moxie Hotel Overview.